so now we're getting ready to head into Camp Sesame. Beaches is known to have one of the best kids program of any resort, cruise line, or any type of hospitality industry in the entire world. They have an incredible relationship with Sesame Street. They use everything that the kids are familiar with from Sesame Street. I think just about every kid grew up with that, including myself and Taylor. And in here, they have the separate spaces. They start with the tiniest of kids, and then they all go all the way up to the teens and tweens spread out throughout the resort. But this particular area is for the kiddos from basically zero up to four and a half. There's some really incredible spaces and something for every single kid. Follow me on inside. So as soon as you enter the doors here, you're gonna have your check-in desk. As soon as you arrive here on the property, you can come over, get everything all set up for the kids. And of course, if you're in the Butler Villa level, they're gonna take care of that for you as well. But as soon as you get here, you're gonna check in. And this is divided up into different age groups. And something really, really unique here on site is that they can take the littlest of kids. Oftentimes, the very smallest ones, just a few months old, they'll use the Camp Sesame over in Key West because it's a little bit quieter, but of course, they can accommodate them here as well. They do change diapers, feed them, and they can take care of them throughout the day and even provide nanny services into the evening as well if you would like. Let me show you the first space. As we head on in, I just wanted to point out that they do have strollers and wagons for rent. If you don't want to bring one with you, you can take advantage of these here. Now through this space, you're gonna find the, the spot for infants and the nap room. So you can see they've got this set up for the tiniest of kiddos. I love that they have that here because once again, so many places start at three or four and up. Here, you can bring any kid and they're gonna have a great time. So you've got the little ball pit area here, different kind of stuffed animals. And then you see they have the full nap area. They also have stations back here where the kids can sit and rock to sleep. What always blows my mind is how amazing they are with the little ones. You walk in here, I know when my daughter was tiny, they have all of them down for a nap and frankly, it's a skill I wish I had. Now my background is as an educator. I was a middle school teacher for 10 years and something that I really, really take to heart and appreciate about Beaches is that they are committed to making sure that every single child is cared for and that every child can have an incredible experience. Of course they have that amazing partnership with Sesame Street, but I wanted to point out that they go out of their way to make sure and include Julia, who's one of the Sesame Street puppets that's on the spectrum, to make sure that every child feels included. And you can see up here that they are a certified autism center, and they make sure that every one of their staff members is fully trained in that. Now, of course, every single kid naps at different times and all of that, so they have these nice little spaces set up throughout. Maybe there's nap time going on back there. Some kids are sitting here watching TV, and of course, all of the furniture, and then, of course, more of the Sesame Street characters are here to play with them. Now, this room is for the one to two and a half year olds, and you can see they always ask people to take their shoes off when they come in. Once again, part of that commitment to every single child. You can see here they have the different chairs and loungers set up for movie time. You also have the tables with the small chairs all throughout, a ton of different toys, and the continuation of that Sesame Street partnership. They do the letter of the day. They do all of those different things so that not only is your kid here having a good time, but they're also learning and growing as you go. At beaches, it's very, very common to see a kid who's been here at six months old come back again at two, three, four, all the way through their teen years. And some of our friends, this is the place where they come back every single year because they have figured out exactly how to handle their kids' needs and they do a great job with it. You see, you have another one of the ball pits. You have all of these different little scooters. And as you know, if one kid wants one, usually they all do as well. So they have a lot of redundancy in here. See the count over there in the corner, changing station, because like I mentioned, unlike a lot of other resorts, they will change the kids and they also will feed them. Now we're gonna explore the other wing of Camp Sesame. I did wanna point out that even the bathrooms are set up perfectly for the little ones. I know when my daughter was potty training, having something that was her size, really easy to access, made a huge difference. Now you see here, they have another play area. Once again, they have lots of different separate areas for different kids doing different things so that each member of the family can be accommodated. Now we're in the first of two spaces dedicated to the three and four and a half year olds. So this particular room is the playroom. You can see they have a ton of toys. They've got the big Lego blocks, more of all our Sesame Street friends. You can see they have small tables here and chairs, perfect for arts and crafts. They're gonna have something for them to do every single hour that they're open here. And then once again, they can continue that on even into the room with their nannies. Now let me head into the activity room, the second space devoted to them. 
You can see here they have it set up for a little tea party. Of course, they're going to eat in here. They'll have snack time. They have a little puppet studio over in the corner. They have a stage up here as well. But what's so cool about that partnership with Sesame Street is they have the characters that will be here in the room for the kids to play with and enjoy. They also put on a show. They'll do the letter of the day and things like that. But their friends are also going to be all around the resort. So you may be sitting at the pool or the beach or somewhere else, and then you can check out the Sesame Street characters. It's so cool, and you see the kids' eyes light up when they see them. They also have a special character breakfast as well, if that's something you're interested in. I absolutely love the outdoor space here. They have the own pool just for the kids right here, a large shade structure set up over it. And look at these lounge chairs. I mean, how cool is that? They're tiny, they're for the littler kids, and of course they have their own umbrellas where they can sit and lounge just like the adults. They really do take care to make sure that every age group, every member of the family or group is taken care of. You can see in the distance there, they have the shower for the kids to shower off on. Once again, smaller in size for them. They have this picnic area right here where they can eat outside. And once again, it's under a shade structure, which I think is great. And finally, to wrap it up outside here, they even have their own beach area. So this is all sand from the beach. They got a little bit table, playhouse, and then of course, more of those super cute loungers. Any little kid is going to love this. Tucked just behind Camp Sesame, you're gonna find this kids play area. They've got a great rock climbing wall here. There's a couple of them actually. The small tables and chairs spread throughout. They also have the playground set. Who doesn't like a teeter-totter over there? And then of course, my daughter's all-time favorite, the swings. And I, what I like about this area is they do use it with the kids club. But in addition to that, you can stop by here anytime with your kids. They can have a great time, head on back down to the pool or the beach, wherever it is that you wanna explore. They also have a throne big enough for me and Big Bird, but uh, somebody's always there. So this space is the Camp Sesame in Key West. There's a couple different spaces. They have a nap room in a separate area just over to my right. And in here, you've got a full service kids zone. You got a small kitchenette in the corner. You've got the bathrooms that are perfect size for the kids. And right now it's actually set up for the zero to 12 months old, but they mix and match depending on the needs of who's staying at the resort, how many kids, different times of year. But what we've always found is this is a little bit quieter. There's usually less kids over here because this is the far side of the resort and a lot more take advantage of the Camp Sesame in the Caribbean village. But what you'll see here is a continuation of what they have over there. The incredible partnership with Sesame Street where you're learning in addition to having fun. You can see they have all of the little rockers where the kids can sit, rock and uh, well, take a nap of course, or they can play in the ball pit there. You've got the little play toys over to the side. And then over here, they have a ton of puppets. One of the things they do, of course, in that partnership with Sesame Street is all the different puppets and there's a learning experience tied to each. But what really makes a kid's club, it's not the spaces, it's the people. And what we find is that our customers who come here love it so much that they come back year after year. In fact, I was just talking to a family who's been here seven years in a row. They have a child who's on the spectrum and his needs have been met perfectly here from a young age all the way through, which means that every member of the family is happy, his brothers, sisters, mom and dad, and begs to come back here every single year. But the people that work here, like I said, make all the difference. What you see is when you come back, their eyes light up, the kids' eyes light up. They're so happy that you're here. They're so happy that they work here. It's such an incredible experience. So depending on which age groups they have over here at different times, you see they have a great outdoor space as well, kind of a jungle gym. You've got a rock climbing wall. You've got a ladder in the back there. You see over here, you've got a couple swings. Of course, the slide and some more climbing over in the corner. I also like that they have sand over here, so it's like a giant sandbox. You can play in that sense as well. I know one of the things that my daughter absolutely loves is as we're wandering around the resort, we run into some of our all-time favorite friends. And of course, well, me and Cookie. Cookie. And guess what? We've got a few other friends too. Bert, Ernie, Elmo, the whole gang is here for a party. And guess what? They love the mac and cheese cart too, huh? Yeah, yeah. All right, thanks guys, you guys rock. Uh, Grover's always bringing up, well, anyway. Just kidding, just kidding. Oh, sorry. Okay, all right, always grumpy, whatever. Now we're inside Port Royal, which is actually an indoor outdoor space. This is for kids of all ages. They're gonna have foosball, ping pong, pool, air hockey, they always have some TVs on there. They do activities here throughout the day as well, including their game squad games, where you can play all kinds of interactive games, once again, for every age group and member of the family. 
One thing that I think is really cool is that in addition to all of these, they even have the air hockey and some of the games for the smaller kids. I know my daughter, niece, and nephew would love it in here. Located just off the side of the water park, you're gonna find the Shadow Lounge. This is for teens and tweens. It's just a place to hang out and relax. They have several different spaces throughout the entire resort for that. So you've got a couple pool tables in here, one of my all-time favorites, of course, air hockey, foosball over in the corner, a couple places to sit and chill, and then ping pong. Once again, this is that place to sit and relax and enjoy, and then they're gonna have different programming throughout the day. Another awesome space for every member of the family is the Xbox Lounge. Beaches has a partnership with Xbox and all around this space, it's absolutely huge. They have every kind of game that you can imagine. You see you have all of these small TVs. They've got some bigger ones spread out. Back here, they actually have the Xbox Connects with a lot of space to spread out. Maybe you wanna do a dance competition with your friends or family. Keep in mind, this is for those who are young and once again, young at heart. So anybody can come in here and enjoy and it's usually open just about all of the day and into the evening. Thank you so much for joining us today. When you are ready to book your vacation here, the most important thing is that you deal with an expert. We know the space is inside and out. We can make sure everything is set up before you arrive so you can have that vacation of a lifetime, whether it's a couple or you wanna do a full wedding, a family group, multi-generational taking over those four bedrooms. We can take care of all the details for you so you can sit back, relax, and have the vacation of a lifetime at an incredible value.